Eight-year-old triplets Nora, Anna, and Ella Cope are a hoot. Oh, but they have egg on it for my breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> they were all too excited to show off their National Park shirt. She got Grand Canyon, which I love. And badges from the incredible adventure they had as a family. This one is a junior ranger bag. Last year during the pandemic, mom Leah tried to keep up with all the girls' classes and homework, but it was a challenge. So I had three different teachers and three different sets of assignments, so um, that was making me a little bit crazy. So um, I decided to do some research on my own and, and figure out what we needed to do to homeschool. What she found was that if she could teach them at home, she could also teach them on the road. We really wanted to travel. So uh, that's sort of how we got into homeschooling. The Copes spent more than 100 days in 2020 in their camper, and they just got back from another 83 days on the road this summer. 20 national parks, um, a number of state parks, national monuments, um, just exploring the outdoors and sort of learning through life experiences, which is important to us. Each of the girls had their favorite stops along the way. My favorite spot was Yosemite. Probably Zion because I like the waterfalls. I love the hot springs. And they discovered some perks to homeschooling. I love because I got to pick my favorite subject first, so I always got to do math first. It's much better sitting in a beanbag chair than in a hard plaster chair. <laughs> <laughs> they even learn lessons you can't teach from a textbook. Since the pandemic happened, I got to see my dad more often and my mom more often. Not every day is like Disney, but when you get to travel, you get to see new places, and you don't usually get to do that at where you live. And lessons best taught by mom and dad. My mom and dad say that when that we get to go back. It might not mean much to us as a kid right I now, even? but then when we grow up and get to visit all these places again, it's gonna mean so much. I didn't ever think that we would have this kind of time, so we really took uh, lemons of the pandemic and turned them into lemonade and made it work in our favor. So I'm happy about the experience. I hope the girls are too.